Hi guys, welcome to Bite Size Excel. In our previous videos, we had a look at the mid and the find functions. And in this short video, we're going to take a quick look at how you might combine these functions to pull out some text from, say, the center of a string of text, where the start and the end is of a non-standard length. So in these examples, we have a full reference number with a dash separating certain elements. And what we want is just this number section in the middle. So each of the middle sections is five characters long with a dash in front. And we're going to use the find and the mid functions to pull this out into a separate cell. So to do that, what we do is we start with our mid function. So it's mid. And the next part of our function is the text we want to pull our data out of. So we select our cell. Now, this is where it becomes a little bit difficult because the next one is the start number and in each of the cells, it's in a different position. So this is where we start using our find function. So what we do is we put in find and we want to find the first dash within our cell. So we find our dash and then we put in the cell we want to find our dash in, close our brackets, now, we don't want it from just the dash, so that will give us the position within our cell that our dash is in, but we want one past it, so we put plus one. And then the next part is the number of characters you want to pull out of your text, and in this each of these cells it's five, so we put in five, close our brackets, and you'll find that it pulls your characters out. And if we drag it down, you'll see that's happened across the board. And that's despite each of these start sections being a different length. Now there's obviously a number of ways you can use your left, right, mid, find and search functions. There is also a, another function called len, which basically returns how long and how many characters are within a cell. So if we select this one, it will tell me there's 14 characters in that cell. So you can combine all these characters in a range of different ways to pull particular text out of a string of text. I do hope that you found this introductory video on how you might combine things like your mid and find function to pull out the text within the middle of a string of text useful. Please do like and subscribe, leave me a comment on what you'd like to see in future videos, and I do look forward to seeing you on the next video.